Welcome guys, today in this video we will be looking at PP Bison. Most people think that PP Bison is a joke weapon, but if you use it properly then it can be really powerful. So if you want to learn how to use Bison at its full capacity, then you need to understand its advantages and disadvantages, so you can better utilize the gun. The most important thing you need to know about the gun is their weapon stats. Many players assume that Bison has low damage which isn't completely true, it has a base damage of 36.5, and a headshot damage of almost 63, and rest all as shown in the screen. 36.5 base damage isn't that bad it's very decent, but when we put it next to UMP and Tommy gun, it does look like it has low damage. But if we see what kind of ammunition they use, and compare it next to all the SMGs then you'll start to understand that PP Bison has the highest damage in its ammo category. You must be wondering if Bison's damage is really this good, then why does it feel like it doesn't do a lot of damage? Well this is where the rate of fire comes in. This is one of the Bison's biggest weakness. Because PP Bison is the slowest firing SMG, its rate of fire is almost identical to the Tommy gun. This is why some players say Bison shoots peas, as it doesn't deal any damage to the opponents, which takes us to the DPS, here's the damage per second for all the SMGs, it's kinda sad to see Bison at the bottom of the list, but this also shows us that Bison is the weakest SMG, when it comes to gun power. So theoretically if there is a direct gunfight between Bison versus other SMGs, Bison will lose the gunfight most of the time since Bison doesn't have the raw gun power. This is just one of its main disadvantages, but this doesn't mean that Bison is weakest weapon. PP Bison is a very unique weapon and one of its kind. The special thing about Bison is that it doesn't need an extended mag, I mean it cannot equip any extra mags by default it can hold 53 rounds which is crazy for an SMGs, whereas every other SMG must have an extended mag. And now to the recoil. I'm not gonna say Bison has no recoil, it does have some recoil which is very easy to handle, plus its recoil patterns are almost straight. So you can accurately control its recoil without shaking left and right. By the way Bison has only two attachment slots one for muzzle attachment which can be used to reduce the recoil up to 10%, and the other one is scope attachment slot it can equip scopes up to 6x which is uncommon for SMGs, but it's nice to have that. So can we use Bison for mid to long range? Well yes but actually no, SMGs are not great when it comes to shooting at far distances. But it doesn't mean you can't use them, you can still use, but it's gonna be harder to connect your shots, and the damage will be extremely low. However if your target is stable, and doesn't move at all, then you can connect your shots much better. And Bison's recoil is very stable and easy to control. But I would not recommend you to use SMGs like this, SMGs are designed for close range, and they lose their performance as the distance increases. Well here are some tips on when should you use, and how should you use the PP Bison at its best. Bison would be a pretty average weapon during the first phase of the game, or in the beginning of the match. That is the best time to run a Bison, as soon as you get to the mid phase, you should swap out Bison with other reliable weapons. And in end game phase, Bison is a big no-no. It's the worst time to run a Bison, since everyone will have level 3 gear and airdrop guns, so you will have no chance to win against them with your Bison. So swap out Bison in the mid phase. And the best way to use this gun is obviously not using too often, however one thing you need to keep in mind while using PP Bison, it's a very weak weapon, so you will lose a direct gunfight against almost all the weapons, but you can still attack them from behind and other sides, never attack from the front. But if you want to take a direct gunfight, make sure you're the guy who fires first. Otherwise you have less odds on winning that fight, so instead wait in a cover for them to push. The best advantage about the Bison is you can pre-fire like crazy, with 53 rounds you can most likely push with a pre-fire. And never play aggressively with Bison, because it has less damage per second. Anyway that's all I got for this video I hope you learned something new today, if you did hit the like button and subscribe for more upcoming videos like these, see you guys in the next one, enjoy my bot gameplay.